Hey y'all, Fuller again with Custom Offsets. Custom Offsets TV on the YouTube. Got another vehicle spotlight for you. This is a 2016 Silverado 2500 HD on some giant specialty forge. Let's check it out. Hey guys, you know, this is a pretty big build. It's a beautiful truck. We can't let Fuller run around with the old clipboard thing and walk you through this one. So I'm gonna jump in, take you through it. Um, like I believe he would have said, these are the 22 by 14, these are specialty Forge SF010s. And that's gonna be a 14 inch wheel on a negative 76 offset. So she's gonna have that nice big fat forged wheel lip. And you're gonna see that it's gonna eat up a $100 bill in a heartbeat. It's usually right around nine inches, probably just short or right close to nine inches of lip on that. And this is gonna be a polished wheel, so you have to take good care of it. Um, it's about time to clean these up because we drove around the block twice. And then the tires, it's gonna be wrapped in a 375-45 R22, which is basically a little over a 35 and then almost 15 inches wide. So it's gonna give it that big, huge, wide stance. And it's also gonna create a nice straight up and down sidewall on that 14 wide. So you're gonna basically get that real square looking setup. And then for suspension to get these to fit, you're gonna be looking at the um, six and a half inch BDS lift kit. And it's gonna have the Fox shock upgrade up front, Fox shocks in the rear. And even with that, because you're with that 14 wide and then that 15 inch wide tire, it's gonna be a pretty good amount of trimming. So up front here, you're gonna see that we had to take off the entire bumper end and then get into the valence. Got that all cleaned up, repainted, and then it's still gonna rub back here. The only way to get rid of that is to literally trim this out, trim all of that back and it creates a big hollow spot because there's nothing behind there. So a lot of times what we're doing is bumping that back as much as we can and then you just accept the little bit of rub that it still has when you get to about three quarter crank. And that's just part of having 14 wides and 15 inch tires on the um, six and a half on a Silverado. So we'll take you through the rest of this truck. You'll see that it's gonna have the uh, color match front, color match bumper with the uh, black bow ties. And that's gonna be the package of this truck. You'll see the top of the line mirror, tow mirrors there. It's definitely the Duramax. I take a peek inside all the bells and whistles. It's got the sunroof full leather interior. Pretty much every option the truck is offered with. And then it's full crew cabs. So it's gonna have the full crew back. You'll see it's got the chrome handles, chrome underneath the uh, windows, chrome door trim, and then the chrome step up. That's all gonna be stock with this package. And then coming around back, you'll see the black bow ties again, painted rear bumper, backup sensors, all that jazz. You see it does have stock exhaust on it. It's just absolute beautiful truck. Uh, one of my favorite things I think is the real sinister looking black headlights that they've done in this truck. And then you'll see it's got the pretty much blacked out cab lights also. 
throws the whole package together. And this one, we did the programmer in it to reprogram it so that the speedo is on. Turned out real good. Makes me a little jealous because it's got the Duramax. CO2 has been staring at it all day, wondering when it's gonna get one, but we ain't doing that anytime soon. Appreciate you guys checking us out. Make sure you subscribe, make sure you follow us. Make sure you like us, peace.